Hello, hello, queens. It's Kanisha with Currency Queen Budgets. In this video, I will be cash stuffing my paycheck for March the 24th, 2023. If that is something you're interested in, stay tuned. All right, guys, so we are going to jump right into this cash stuffing. I feel like it's been ages since I recorded a video. You guys know I've been gone on my vacation, and I really, really enjoyed it. It was much needed, but I also missed you guys as well. But this is the paycheck for March the 24th. Now, this is after March the 24th that I am recording it because March the 24th, I was still on a cruise. Um, so, yeah, let's jump right into it. So, we will be cash stuffing a total of $1,260. Let me get this money straightened out so we can get counted. How has everyone been doing? Any changes with you guys? Um... I can just say all is well on my end. I'm, you know, well rested and I'm ready to get back to my life. <laughs> I didn't want to come home, to be honest with you. But I think I am going to, um, I did do a little vlogging. So I'm going to either insert it in one of these videos or just do kind of a separate video just to show some things that I did do or some things that I see. But let's get this money counted. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred, fifty-two, seven, eight hundred, fifty, nine hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one thousand, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one hundred, twenty, forty, one thousand, one hundred and forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 1,240, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, and 60. So we have 1,260 bucks. All right, so we are going to start with our bills, bills, bills. All right, so for credit cards, we are going to do $30. So that's 20 and a 10, which is 30. The next is our tides, and tides is going to get 60. So we're going to do 50 and 60. And for my card note, I'm going to do, let's do 50. insurance I'm going to do 30 so let's do a 20 and a 10 
for my cell phone, we're gonna do 25. 20 and a five. For my rent, I am going to add seven hundred dollars. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Oh, that is utilities. I am doing too much. Let me get that out. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Did I do utilities already? Or did I just overlook it? What? How did I say rent? I'm just gonna put this in rent since I have it out. I don't know. I was getting ahead of myself. I don't think I stuffed in um, my utilities though. But um, I don't think I did. So utility is going to get 40. Mm. All right, there we go. Okay, so we did rent. Subscriptions isn't getting anything. Um, student loans isn't getting anything either. So that is it for my bills binder. I stuffed a total of $935 in my bills. Okay, so the next thing that we will do is cash stuff my variable expenses. And... As always, this is a receipt I'm going to take out, put it to the side, and I am going to scan that into Fetch. Now, Fetch is an app. If you don't already have it, you need to go ahead and download it right after this video. It's an app that you can scan any receipt that you receive from any store, and you can receive points. And with those points, you can purchase a gift card once they are accumulated to a certain amount i will leave my code across the screen and you can go and download that app enter my code and i will send you some free points and as a thank you you will send me some free points back i just want to say i really appreciate each and every one of you that has used my code y'all thank you for those points i really really greatly appreciate those i am still letting those build up take advantage of that it's free money just for taking the time out to scan your receipts okay so we're going to jump right into this cash stuffing so we are going to start with groceries and for groceries i have left over 20 40 and 60 dollars in which i'm going to take all of my rollover money out um and lay it here but we are going to add a hundred and thirty dollars for groceries for my gas i have a total of i'm gonna lay these ones to the side i have 50 left and uh, I'm just going to lay this to the side as well. I think I just want to empty out all of my rollover money um, for this month. I'm just going to take everything out. And I'll probably just put it over into my savings challenges. But for gas, I am going to add in 75 So that's 20 40 60 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, and 75. 
and I'm taking the roller over money out for the first time. I've had a lot of money. Um, well, I won't say a lot of money, but I have had money left over maybe all of this year for my cash stuffing. So that money is just kind of really just sitting there. I'm not spending it. So, and that's a good thing, but I am just going to take it out and probably put it over into my savings challenges. Um, for household, I am going to leave this money here because I do need to go to Sam's and pick up a couple of items. But I'm going to add a 20 here. But I will be using that as well this week. For spending, I am going to do 20. I don't have anything in spending. For beauty, beauty is going to get $40. 20, 30, and 40. For eating out, I am going to, I'm just checking to see how much money I have. Um, for eating out, I'm going to do 30. So that's 10, 20, 25 and 30 now this money will be for my daughter um, because I'm not doing any eating out nor am I eating regular foods right now I started juicing once I got back off of my cruise because I didn't take as many pictures as I would have liked to take of myself because y'all I just felt so heavy I wasn't kind of happy with what I was seeing, so I decided to go on a journey of juicing. I started back working out. I've been mostly um, focused on myself as far as my self-care because I have been working a lot. I haven't been taking care of myself. I work, eat, and sleep. That is basically my life. I haven't been doing nothing outside of that as far as a social life, but I did um make up my mind when I came back that I was going to pour more into myself first before I do anything so I am on a new journey of juicing only fruit and vegetables that I'm, I'm um consuming so y'all pray for me I hope I hope this journey um go well for me and I am liking the results that I have um, seen so far, which has only been a few days, but I can tell that it's working for me. I feel so much better. I have more energy. You know, I'm getting more done. The brain fog is gone, but I might save that for a different video. But y'all just stay tuned and um, be on the lookout for the progress for that. But let's finish this. So medication is going to get $10. And I have 20 in medications, and I was just going to pull that out as well. Um, my receipts, I don't have any because, like I said, I've been on a cruise, so I haven't been spending much money. Oh, I do have my gas receipts. Um, and I'll get those scanned in. My money for my deposit, which was for my gas that we used to drive to the port. Um, I did deposit that in the bank as soon as I got back so oh and let me take out my one dollar bills from here as well I had more one dollars but I did leave some for tips for our driver I'm just going to set that to the side so yeah my driver did get some tips and I did use some of my ones and some of my fives and some of my tens just depending on what I, what I had with me at the moment um but I am going to put these one dollar bills into my one dollar savings challenges um I have not been going through picking out my k books and there's one right there I need to start back doing that for my K books. I really can go through because I'm going to take this out for my K book because I did have five ones left over 
for from my um gas. So yeah, I'm gonna take that one out and I am going to put it in my handy dandy K book box. I still have it here on my desk. And I just haven't been coming or coming across any K books for some reason. One while I had a, a big spurt and I was finding them everywhere, but to be honest, I really haven't been um I haven't been on the lookout for them. And it's it don't want to go in here. <laughs> okay, now we got it in there. Um, and it's kind of full. I may need to find another box for my K books and get back on that journey. And this will go. Oh, this is savings challenge money. So we're going to add that in here. The rest of our mula. Alright guys, so that is it. And that is all. If you have not already, please go ahead, like and subscribe. Leave me a comment and don't forget to push that notification bell so you are notified every time I upload content. Thank you guys. And you know, as always, hustle hard, budget hard, and pray harder. Be blessed, Queenies. Bye.